Yo, what is going on guys? My name is Nolan Roberts back with NFL Talks and today we are going to be talking about like passive, semi-passive or just easy overall ways to make coins in Madden 22 Ultimate Team. Now, obviously, you know, there's some new limited times out. Uh, Chase Claypool and Vita Vey, 98 overall. Probably, probably menaces to society if you do somehow acquire those cards. Still got the 96 Bengals team team. Not really any additions made. Although, I do got to get the new heavyweight Riley Reef because then my right tackle will be a 96. And that would be pretty solid. So, got to get that card. Obviously, this is a coin making method video and I have 4k coins don't ask about it I blew them all in packs just for fun and got basically nothing but training and so let's just get right into this all right so one of the first ways that that it's really just a consistency thing and it's not like you don't even have to grind the game for it you just have to be consistent so, so let's go over to solo battle so obviously the play tab where, where all of like the games and stuff and everything you play is you're gonna go down to solo battles the second one down and obviously there's an 85 featured opponent that you get a uh, boost you, you get battle score okay and if you just play two of these games a day i mean they're obviously the 87 overalls they're a little better um but how do i check the rewards here we go so just for doing two games a day which i think you get if you do the the hardest difficulty that's 21,000 per game i think a little over that maybe so say you do two games a day for for five days that that's that's 200k right there i find no 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 my math is so off that's a hundred that's a hundred thousand points okay so you're at least getting veteran but if you keep playing and you play all the games possible say you play like three full games a day that's that's for just for five days though that's 150,000. so you're gonna get all star and that's that's pretty decent coins and packs right there but if you really grind it and you play more than five days, because I believe solo battles goes on for the entire week. So if you play the entire week and and, and, and get all this done, you could possibly get up to legend and get the fifty nine thousand and all those packs and everything. And but but if you just play the two games a day, you're guaranteed you know veteran or or star, and that's easy packs and coins that you can get at the end of the week. Plus there's the monthly ones, and it's 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 pretty easy if you have just a somewhat decent team and you somewhat know what you're doing. Um, obviously if you don't have the best team, you're probably gonna want to go just a tad low. Uh, difficulty other than that it's a great way to just now the second method is a little bit more complicated than that mutt champions now it's basically you know used to be called weekend league it, it's a very it's very competitive I'm not gonna lie um, so if you are gonna play this you do kind of have to either a have a, have a pretty decent team or oh, apparently I have some rewards from when I played weekend league a while ago is it gonna give me the rewards continue Right. Well, let's look at the leaderboard right here. So obviously, I don't have any games played because I haven't played this weekend. Um, I haven't gotten into it yet. So let's just you get you get 25 games to play. Okay. Now, just by winning seven games, you get you can get veteran. Ten gives you star. Now you really want to get into the all star range. If you can just win half of your games, if you can go 13 and 12, it's gonna make a huge difference for your team. Um, I don't exactly know how to check. The what's it called? Even leaderboards, maybe. I don't exactly know how to check the rewards. That's what I'm currently trying to find out. Ah, man, that dude's going five and zero right now. Dang. All right, where where is the rewards though? Is, is the real question? Is it event details? Yes, 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 yes. All right, so let's go all the way down here. Um. Just for winning te the 10 games, you get star, which is 50k in a veteran tier pack plus a redstone, red, red zone pack. Um, that's easy coins, and if you do that for, for a whole month, that's 200k plus the monthly rewards, okay? Mind that. And then if you get the 13 wins, that's 70k, a veteran tier pack, and two red zone packs. And if you're really good at Madden, you get 16, then you get the 95k and, and those touchdown packs and all-star packs. I mean, and, and if obviously if you're a top 100 player, you're just god above gods and you just get all that god tier stuff so just by playing solo battles and trying your best in weekend league you are destined to get about 150 to 200k extra a week and, and, and in my mind that is definitely serviceable coins that can go towards any type of upgrade i mean crap 150k 200k in one week would get my right tackle all the way upgraded and possibly boost my offense to 97 but i don't think it would but it still could you never know and so, yeah, solo battles and mud champions kind of go hand in hand. And that is that for coin making number one and two. On to number three. 
For number three, it sounds pretty basic, but head-to-head -head season. It's actually underrated how much coins this gives you. Now, I'm, I believe I am actually struggling in my season currently because I'm in quite a tough... Oh, I think I, yeah, I just lost my thing, actually. We're not even going to look into that. But, but per win, I was getting 5,300 a win, which I believe that's all-star. I'm not exactly sure. Um... But 5,300 coins per win. So if you go to the playoffs, that's 7 times 500 or 5,000. That's 35,000 coins. Just by making the playoffs, plus you get the 7 win quick sell, which is about 15K. That's 50K right there. And then if you are good enough to make the Super Bowl and win it, you, you get a ton of rewards. So, like, about a week ago or two, I won the Super Bowl. And I went undefeated. I got the first round buy and everything. And I got, like, 50K for, for just be winning all my regular season games, like, including the 7 win quick sell and then as well as the playoff wins i was getting about 7500 per playoff win that's three of those it's about twenty three thousand right there plus a super bowl appearance plus a super bowl win which is like f i think it was 40k so i got around over 100k and i played the whole season in one day so i got over 100k in one day of just playing one month season so You'd be surprised on just how many coins and how good you can get your team just by grinding head-to-head -head seasons. You may lose a bunch and you may win a bunch, but you're still playing it. You're still grinding your mutt level and you're still getting coins and that's what matters. And obviously the higher division you're in will be, you know, the more coins you get. So those are my three top ways of getting coins. Now, the fourth and final one, pay to win. You can just drop all of the money that you have all the money in your mom and dad's bank account onto either elite fantasy packs gridiron guardians packs pro fantasy packs ultimate legend packs super bowl packs anything get i'm just kidding don't actually get your parents credit card because then then it's my fault the reason that they're down 500 bucks so so please don't um my birthday's coming up march 21st though so i will definitely be doing a huge pack opening for that I, i'm not gonna lie i might have to drop like 100 or 200 on this game but those are just some simple coin making methods that you guys can do just grind your solo battle games and you try your best in weekend league and you can get an easily 150k plus a week plus packs so i i mean it's it's it's, it's efficient. It's very efficient. You just got to really put your mind to things. And the only upgrades we can really do in the Bengals team team is obviously Riley Reeve getting him up to power it up. And, and he would be a 96 overall, I believe. Quentin Spain, his 96 overall, putting him at a 97 powered up. Chad Johnson's ultimate legend will put him at a 99 powered up and everything. And then he would be our starting receiver. So our receivers are stacked right now, as you can see. Like 96, 96, 97, 98, 98. I mean, it's broken. We got Derrick Henry as our, as our power back at 95. Joe Burrow and Carson Palmer, you know, they're beast. I could also get the Munoz upgrade, who's a 97, and then he would be boosted up to a 99 left tackle, which would honestly be pretty nice. Um, we got the 98 linebackers. I do need a better left outside. I am not going to lie. Like, the, the Bengals, or Madden needs to do something about that. <sighs> but the team is looking pretty good today. Trey Waynes is up to a 96, because I got, I got the NAT Trey Waynes. I don't even know how I got him. I think it was just from playing games. Um... Jesse Bates is my fifth corner. I do need to upgrade him. I am not going to lie. We got Cam Chancellor at the backup free safety. Reggie Nelson and Von Bell. Some of the base safeties I've ever used actually in Madden. DJ Reader, Jack Youngblood, Trey Hendrickson, Mike Hilton, Jalen Ramsey's a freebie. I mean, this squad is actually pretty nasty. I'm not going to lie. And obviously, we got all of these boosts because I, cause I upgraded my strategies. So that's just a little team update and some easy ways that you guys can make coins. And I will, in the next video, probably be coming up with a live gameplay video. So do be prepared for that okay and I, I hope you guys do enjoy it but i do appreciate all the support recently let's get this video to hopefully 50 views i mean like one of our uh, one of my recent ones just 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 hit 100 and I, I don't know it's just finally starting to pick up so i do really appreciate the support guys hit that like button down below make sure to subscribe if you are new and comment down below any ideas that you have but anyways guys thanks for watching and my name is nolan roberts from nfl talks peace